So if you have an extracurricular that you've been involved with at home, be it a company that you've created, a community service project you've started, or any other initiative, I encourage you to please submit that to be featured on our channel. Hi, my name's Andy and I'm the founder of Teens Rising Initiative. My name is Nastasia, I'm 15 years old and I'm a student living in Moscow, Russia. Hey there Crimson Education, I'm John Hopcroft. Hi Crimson, my name is Divya, I am 15 years old and I study in Tagore International School, Basan Vihar, New Delhi in the 10th grade. My name is Akam, I'm a high school student and I'm very interested to learn about technology and STEM. A little bit about myself is I grew up in the Bay Area. I currently attend Homestead High School and I'm a rising junior. I also play American football and I also play the bass clarinet. A quick thing about my project is Teens Rising Initiative is an organization that provides not only online classes, but we also offer webinars. The online classes being for middle school and elementary students. And the reason why I started this was when I, when I was in the pandemic, I thought to myself, how many people really have teachers that not only provide a good mentorship experience, but also teach you the subject really well. And I know through my personal experience, I haven't had both of those aspects all the time. And so through Teens Rising Initiative, I bring the high school teachers or our volunteers and bring that amazing mentorship experience that I wish I had and I hope that other people will have eventually through my organization. I've been very passionate about computer science, technology and writing for a very long time now. So that's why I decided to combine all those things together and build my own website for my personal blog, Dice Tech. It's a place where I write about different aspects of technology that I find interesting in a simple and understandable way. And I mean, that's the main idea of it, to make technology seem more fascinating and exciting for people. My posts don't have any difficult vocabulary, terms or expressions. That's why they're suitable for everyone. Thus, it makes my blog a perfect place for those of you who want to learn more about such things as machine learning, AI, and just technology in general, even if you don't know anything about it. So why not a way for students all across New Zealand to directly engage with the vast amount of perspectives from all over this world? This is the goal of the Cosmos Championship, a free international online face-to-face -face debate competition which aims at allowing students all across this country to engage with thousands of people from all around this world, getting to learn the perspectives, cultures and thoughts on different social issues, controversial topics and upcoming events. Such an opportunity has never been worth more, being able to debate people from El Salvador, Sydney, Boston and all across the world due to such turbulent, interesting times. The name of my project is Step Party. In this project, we help groom the underprivileged students of the Samarpan School in Vihar, New Delhi by helping them improve their reading, writing and speaking skills. Along with that, we understand that due to the lockdown, they're not able to go to school. And to compensate for that, we send them recorded lessons wherein the students explain to them various topics and different subjects like biology, chemistry, physics, social sciences, etc. Apart from that, we also groom the LGBTQI community and the acid attack survivors to improve their spoken English so that their self-esteem increases. Thank you and it was a lovely experience sharing my project from India with all of you. Earlier this year, I was trying to figure out how I can share my knowledge with the world. Then it hit me, why not make a YouTube channel? That was the birth of Top Intelligence. Through Top Intelligence, I try to inform people about the current events that are happening in the world right now, such as the very sad death of George Floyd. Not only do I inform, I try to inquire why people made such decisions. Also, you can find STEM based videos on my channel too. This might include unique mutations of the viruses. In the future, I'm trying to include more STEM based videos such as brilliant scientists like Nikola Tesla, scientific breakthroughs, and even technological advancements that can be helpful to the society in the future. I hope when people watch my videos, they learn something new that they can use in the outside world. Thank you.